Next question is calculate the wavelength, frequency and wave number of a light wave whose period is 0 2.0 in 10 to the power minus 10 seconds. So first of all what is given to us in the question? Period is given. Period meaning time itself. There is no difference in it. Period meaning time. From that we need to calculate wavelength, frequency and wave number. So here what is given to us in the question is period or I can also write this as time. This is equal to 2.0 10 to the power minus 10 seconds. What are we as to calculate? Wavelength. We have to calculate frequency and we need to calculate wave number. So these are the three things we need to calculate from period or time given to us. So here when we check a formula for period or time which is equal to 1 by frequency. But in this case you need to find out what is frequency when period is given. So I will write frequency is equal to 1 by period. So we know what the formula is 1 divided by period is 2.0 into 10 to the power minus 10 seconds. When I simplify this I will get 0 0.5 into 10 to the power minus 10 will become plus 10 seconds will become seconds inverse. Now this itself when you write down the answer this when we shift to the right this will become 5 into 10 to the power 9 seconds inverse. So that is our frequency here. So we got the first one where they are asking us to calculate what is the frequency. Now we know what is frequency. It is easy for us to calculate the wave number because we know a relation between both. Therefore frequency is equal to C by lambda. This is the relation. But in this case you need to find out what is lambda. So lambda is equal to C by frequency. C is a constant which is velocity of light. So we write 3 into 10 to the power 8 meter per second divided by frequency is what we just found out now which is 5 into 10 to the power 9 seconds inverse. Now here these two will get cancelled and we can now solve it 3 by 5 will give as 0 0.6 into 8 minus 9 because plus 9 when it goes up becomes minus 9 so this will be 10 to the power minus 1 meter again when we shift a decimal over here we will get 6 into 10 to the power minus 2 meter now this is going to be the wavelength we have one more value to find out which is the wave number so wave number is equal to 1 by lambda what lambda you found out right now, we can get a relation between this and wave number, which is 1 by lambda. But lambda is already given to us here. Lambda, wave, your wave number is equal to 1 divided by 6 into 10 to the power minus 2 meter. When we divide 1 by 6, we will get 0 0.166 into 10 to the power. Minus 2 will become plus 2. Meter becomes meter inverse. When we shift the decimal, this will be by two places 16.6 meter, meter inverse. So we have all three values here. We have the value for frequency calculated from period. Whatever frequency value you got, you can calculate your wave your wavelength. Whatever wavelength you got, you could calculate what your wave number is. So three values are there. And accordingly, we can solve such problems.